antiderivative or def indefinite integral integration. We, I call it integration. It's the antiderivative because it's the opposite of derivatives. They use capital F is the antiderivative of F. So you ever see a capital F? It means integral, antiderivative. Antiderivative again is the indefinite integral. This is the formula for it. This little symbol means integrate. Now, do you see we have a derivative here? If we integrate a derivative in respects to x, that dx, you always have this dx thing here. It's describing what you're doing in terms of. Um, if you have this, you come back to the original equation plus some constant. It goes back to like there's a whole bunch of graphs as answers, and we got a pinpoint one we'll talk about later. So again, if you take the integral of a derivative, you go to the original function plus a constant. People forget this constant all the time. You'll see why. Let me show you where it comes from. If you have y equals a function, what is this right here? Isn't that the derivative of the previous? Isn't this right here a differential of this? Went from my derivative to my differential. Now, if I integrate both sides, if I integrate dy and I integrate this side, are we okay? The integral of dy is y. We'll talk about that. The integral of this, isn't it right there? Is f of x. There really should be a plus c, but for now I didn't put it there. But do you understand we went full circle? From here we derived it, made it a differential, integrated both sides, went back to the original. There should be a plus c, but in general we kind of knew what the original looked like so we could go back to the original. There's something called a particular solution. That's when you integrate, then you plug in a coordinate to find c, to find out the exact value of your original equation. You need a point from your original equation to find the exact equation. And we'll talk about that more. But you always have to find your c to get a particular solution. Basically, when you get this right here, something like this, it's called a general solution. General because you don't have exactly what it is. Particular means you pinpointed it by plugging in a coordinate. 